So later on in the evening, about two hours after the last time uh, we saw this moose, he came back down. This would be now about the end of the um, major feed period, the lunar period. And uh, he's a heck of a lot more confident of himself this time. I was able to move in a heck of a lot closer there. He's given him a, uh, a big shiver, but uh, he knew I was around. It kept an eye on me. It was actually interesting because he was uh, keeping an eye on uh, the cattle that were coming through the bush. That seemed to capture his attention at times um, and lots of other noises. But uh, I was downwind of him, so he didn't hear me or sent me, but he saw me and I didn't seem to bother him. Again, while I was recording here, the wind picked up significantly and um, I was blowing down the lake. I had to pull in my lines and um, yeah, I was on a pretty good drift here. But he didn't seem to uh, worry about me at all as he was casually eating. So as, as I was uh, fishing, I was able to get in a little bit closer. And uh, you can see how deep the water is there as he's browsing around and uh, drinking and eating some of the uh, vegetation that's coming up. The lily pads are starting to come up down in that area. But he's a magnificent animal. Again, he knows I'm there. Ooh, a little shaky on the old camera. But he's looking around. Now he's getting stuck in some of the mud there, and he's also noticing me. And he's decided that he's going, I'm a little bit close. He's decided he's going to go across the lake. Make a little bit of noise there, but it's pretty sticky on the bottom. And uh, I'm not sure he's getting too excited about me or he's shaking himself off there and casually getting out of the water. Now this was uh, now about 9 o'clock, 9.15 in the evening. So the sun's uh, behind the mountains. It hasn't completely gone down yet. As you can see, I still got a pretty good picture of it. Now he seems to be getting a little excited, wants to scare anything off that was close to him. That's where the cows were coming through the bushes too, so. He's just got a little set of horns on him right now, but that's, uh, you know, it's still early in the year and they're just starting to grow. I'm not sure how old he is. I think he's a young one. Not more than uh, maybe three years old. But again, I'm not a specialist in that area. But that's a Duffy Lake uh, moose, and uh, 